Take a look at this pizza, mamma mia. Today on this episode, I'm gonna show you guys how to make a real Neapolitan pizza at the school of the Veraccia Pizza Napoletano. <laughs> Ragazzi and benvenuti and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time, my name is Carmine Castadella. I'm one of the 92 people all of America certified the Neapolitan pizza. I'm very passionate and energetic about real authentic Italian cuisine and my favorite pizza Napoletana. Andiamo! It's gonna be a long trip, but let's go guys, come on. Hey, come on. Hey, People want to know, they're asking, what is a real Neapolitan? Is it 70% hydration, 80% hydration? What are all these hydrations for? Pepe? Tell me. Okay, for this type of zero zero hours, and uh, to a minimum of 12 hours, from 50 to 60, 61%. You hear, guys, the Polish, it bigger. these are not Napolitan, right? No, that's bakers. People make bread. Yeah, those are bakers. Those are not pizza. 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 We're gonna go behind the scenes of how we do the dough. This is the recipe. One liter of water. A gram and a half of fresh yeast. 45 grams of sea salt. 1600 of flour. So, first thing, we wanna put in all the water, put all the salt, mix it all by hand. 10% of the flour. So right now we're creating una pasta. We're gonna put in all the lievito. If you're using sourdough, 150 grams. Keep incorporating all the flour little by little until you see that it comes like a nice, Green consistency. We're gonna push all the flour into the middle to incorporate oxygen. At this point, we're gonna leave some flour on the side and this is what your dough should look like. Now you're gonna get your hands and we're gonna press to the center. And we're gonna make sure that it's not too sticky. When you see it's a little sticky, we're gonna add a little flour and we're gonna do this about 15 minutes until it's nice and smooth. Oh, my friend over here, come and style. We got Mario. Mario here. He does a good job actually incorporating the flour from the bottom. Beautiful grandmother style. We try to incorporate more hair as possible. So the dough in about six to eight hours is gonna be ready to be baked. Oh, yeah. Now that your dough is all done, we wanna do the window test. We're gonna grab the dough and stretch it and see if it passes under light. What up? After 15 minutes, your dough is all ready. That means schiaffo in Italian. It means a nice smack. It means when somebody's getting a mario down, they're schiaffo. So you, you go from the top of the key here, you? coming down, okay. close your thumb, okay. three fingers underneath, and bring the flat on your hand and wrist. Okay. And now the slab. You hear it? And you help with your other hands. Now, you don't move your hands, all right? Okay. Look, I start from here. Follow the tag. I see my hands, they're always in the same position. So we don't need to do it fast. Thing. We just gotta make sure that we're, we're making it to the three best pizza I never see in my life are people that really touch the dough a few times. All these people that do it, you gotta give a nice schiaffo. That's right? so why we yeah. have a schiaffo. <laughs> so when they get me out, you just say, hey, don't smack, that's it. You give a nice schiaffo. Exactly. <laughs> we're just gonna spray some of the pizza. Little 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 Before I approach the bring of the pizza, I'm gonna move the pizza. Make sure that it doesn't stick. You see, this is already sticking a little bit. Because we take it too long, right? And now, I'm gonna drag the pizza on. Mm -hmm. Adjust the center, in this case, the size is already. Go in, let it go. Can you feel just like, just a little bit of color. Yeah. You gotta be gentle, like Pepe Mieri says. You gotta treat the pizza like a woman. Okay, from our house to your house. Mamma mia, buongiorno la pizza! Yeah. 